हेलो व्यूअर्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एन इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक फ्रॉम एलजेब्रा राइट एंड हियर वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व सम इक्वेशंस इन्वॉल्विंग ग्रेटेस्ट इंटीजर फंक्शन एंड फ्रैक्शनल पार्ट फंक्शन राइट सो हियर वी हैव द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम वी हैव टू सॉल्व फॉर एक्स वेन वी हैव दिस इक्वेशन राइट सो हियर द इक्वेशन गोज लाइक दिस दिस इज द ग्रेटेस्ट इंटीजर ऑफ एक्स माइनस फोर is equal to two times of fractional part of x right and here we have to find the valid values of x uh, which satisfies this equation right so let us call this equation as equation number 1 so here uh, we'll uh, start from the fractional part function right so we know that uh, the domain of fractional part function is the set of all real numbers right and uh, the range of uh, fractional part function is the interval uh, 0 to 1 where 0 is included right so here we have 0 here we have 1 and uh, if we uh, uh, if we bold this 0 uh, here uh, then uh, the range of this fractional part function it goes from 0 to 1 right and here 1 uh, is not included right okay so here uh, we can now write uh, the fractional part of x is greater than or equal to 0 uh, but it is less than 1 right so this is the starting step to solve this equation right so now uh, from uh, this equation we see that uh, we can write fractional part of x is equal to greatest integer of x minus 4 over 2 right and we can substitute this value over here so we uh, get uh, this inequality and we have now uh, this one right now multiplying this inequality throughout by 2 uh, what we will get uh, will have this inequality right okay so now let us add throughout uh, 4 so here we have 0 plus 4 and here we have greatest integer of x minus 4 plus 4 and here we have 2 plus 4 right so this 4 and this 4 get cancelled so here we have 4 and here we have greatest integer of x and here we have 6 right so now we have obtained uh, this inequality so now we have to analyze uh, this inequality right so here we see that we have the greatest integer of x uh, which lies between 4 and 6 Uh, including 4 right and we know uh, from the definition of greatest integer function that uh, uh, the greatest integer uh, x uh, always gives us an integer right so here uh, we'll have uh, the value of uh, greatest integer of x as 4 and 5 right because these are the two Uh, integers which lies between 4 and 6 and here we have the inequality uh, equality sign so we'll also include 4 right okay so once we have obtained uh, these two uh, values uh, we can substitute uh, uh, these two values in this equation right so now let us uh, first take uh, greatest integer of x is equal to 4 right and uh, if we take uh, this value over here uh, then we'll get uh, 4 minus 4 is equal to 2 times of uh, fractional part of x right and this is equal to 0 this is 2 times fractional part of x so fractional part of x is equal to 0 uh, right okay and now from the definition of fractional part of uh, x Uh, we know that fractional part of uh, x can be written as x minus greatest integer of x right so here we write x minus greatest integer of x is equal to 0 right and greatest integer of x is 4 so we can now write x minus 4 is equal to 0 so x is equal to 4 right so this is the first value of x uh, which satisfies this equation right now let us take the second one so now if we take greatest integer of x is equal to 5 and again substituting it over here 
uh, will get 5 minus 4 is equal to 2 times of uh, fractional part of x this is 1 this is 2 times fractional part of x so fractional part of x is equal to half right and again applying this definition so we have x minus greatest integer of x is equal to half for greatest integer of x we can write 5 so we have x minus 5 is equal to half this is a linear equation so we have half plus 5 that is 1 plus 10 over 2 uh, that is 11 over 2 right so the second value is 11 over 2 that is 5.5 right so the solution of uh, this equation are given by x is equal to 4 and 11 over 2 right so this is how uh, we can apply the definition of greatest integer function and uh, fractional part function to solve these type of equations right so this is a very simple problem and in the next uh, video uh, we'll take